Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Dave the Diver here on that your professional walkthroughs channel with me your host Max. So in the previous episode we went through quite a lot of events. We helped Dr. Bacon to uncover the temple. We saw that there are some sort of sea people. One of them got even snatched by the Kraken that keeps attacking the ships with cargo. We saw activists who are trying to protect the region. And of course, we have the VIP who has been announced. So in order to do this, we are going to have to go and we're going to have to bring white spotted jellyfish for Boncho so he can make the meal for him. If we are not gonna bring the white spotted jellyfish, that's a VIP that we have lost, and uh, that's gonna probably be quite negative for us. On top of it, in a couple of days, there's gonna be a jellyfish event, so quite literally, my focus is going to be on one of these dives on acquiring as much jellyfish as I can. And in order to do this properly, I will maybe have to switch to the net gun the reason behind this is so that i can capture the jellyfish alive and therefore be able to harvest them more effectively i'm gonna have to call duff so let's do that ah why are you so angry duff i ordered a limited edition Lesson figurine, I guess. But it hasn't come for over a week. Would you believe it? It's got a serial number and a limited edition only Whoa. art book. Whoa, calm down a bit. Everyone seems upset with this delivery he's having stopped. I think there must be some kind of accident. Mm. To see what's going on, I will need the deep sea headlamp. Okay. Oh, well, of course, I have one of those in my safe storage, yeah. but I can't give it to you for free. There's no. a condition. I think I know what's coming. Yeah. Please find my Leshen Leshen figurine. I think it's pink delivery box. You'll know it when you see it. I okay. think I know exactly where it is. I requested special care for the package, so it should not be washed away. Yeah. If the ship carrying it sank, it's likely to be somewhere nearby. Find it for me, and I'll give you the DC deep sea headlamp. Uh, I'll have to first find the location of the sunken transport ship. But yeah, the thing is, we came across this location multiple times. It's on the left side. Uh, the game developers claim that there's like the biome keep changing, but there's like four or three variations maybe. And in the deeper water, there are some differences as well. I'm sorry I'm yawning so much. It's been a long day and I'm recording this late at night. So I have stuff for the channel while I try to work for some other content. But it's been kind of slow lately. I do apologize. So anyhow, uh, we do have what we need i don't really think i need to craft any of these other things right now hush dart is sleeping we do have the sniper rifle even the triple axle can be crafted i don't care we were able to acquire uh tiger shark tiger shark was the brand new shark which i was able to capture and prepare lovely lovely meals out of them it for some dumbass reason it's not appearing in here and i'm not really sure why a dolphin is in the list why would you do that that's so weird don't don't make me eat dolphins come on not cool so we're gonna try to uh go after the je jellyfish i have a lot of money so let's see if we can get some upgrades for our diver suits uh a harpoon gun would be nice i think i want to upgrade the cargo hold it's 1375 gold right now i will go for it because that's gonna allow me to carry quite a lot and 
Yeah, we need white spotted jellyfish. Okay, the biome has definitely changed. Definitely changed. Actually shocked. They're gonna make me work for this goddamn delivery, huh? Okay, let's see what's waiting for us over here. I really wanna capture the jellyfish alive, hence I'm gonna hold on to the net gun. Even though it's kind of problematic that trying to rely on it is gonna be problematic, especially if I will come across more dangerous species. Uh, sharks and species like that can be only shot by the actual... ...guns themselves, so fishing, the fishing net is not really what you're looking for. Almost looks like there's some sort of entry points. Like you swipe a card or something and there's a door. I do wonder if the sea people are gonna reach out to me as well, because one of them got uh, captured. But we're gonna see, we're gonna see. But definitely, they did rotate the biome and the diving spot, that's interesting. Okay, there's some ingredient for meals. Still have to find one red star. I'll take the soy sauce so that we can make those more advanced meals. Those meals which truly make more money. Because I cannot keep relying on like hunting just sharks and stuff like that. It's gonna put the whole ecosystem into a terrible, terrible unbalance. So let's not do that. I don't really need a lionfish. I'll take the silver bowl because I can sell these to Cobra. So in case I'll need some extra cash. Oh, come on. What is up? Okay. I'm not really sure how this minigame works. That was weird. This is the first time I came across this thing. I don't know if there has been like an update to the game. I definitely changed the... I'm not sure what the hell to do with this poison... Uh... Poison tip on the harpoon. I need to understand how these damn things work. We have picked up officially an upgrade for the net gun. But all things considered, it's still gonna be kind of funky. I don't know if on this dive I'll be able to acquire the... Toy or the collectible, sorry. Sorry. I should know better. It's a collectible, it's not a toy. There's a huge difference. Sure, let's take uh, the trigger bombs. Not really thrilled about them, but it's not like I have an option right now. Oh my god, what's up with all these explosives? Okay, so here is the ship. They definitely changed the upper layers. I'll definitely swap out this. And here's our collectible. Let's not make that mistake again. There are my precious... Lesson. Bring it to me quick. Finish your mission. What would a Kraken need the goddamn thing for in the first place? Ok, 
Okay, uh, uh, what was just that now? My lesion! They disappeared into the unfor unfathomable depths. It seems to have been some kind of giant life form. Please go and retrieve her. Wait, you obviously... It, that obviously looks dangerous. Besides, the doors on that ship are locked, so I can't go inside. Do you really think I didn't think of that before concocting Les Chan rescue plan? Yeah. I'll provide you with my secret weapon, the gas cutter. Even at this moment, Les Chan awaits her master. Come to the boat, will you? Yeah, this guy is weird. But what can I do? Uh, so I did see a shark, but I'm on a hunt for... And I guess I'll try to capture as many as I can, so that I have them even for the festival with the uh, ravers who requested me to bring them uh ooh, tiger 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 there's tiger let's keep messing with the jellyfish really wish i would be able to capture more than one But this should help me prepare also meals for the upcoming festival. Uh, one thing which I however have to look into. It's kind of funny how I'm electrocuting a jellyfish. I need to look for a freaking oxygen. so many rounds not good okay that's the angler fish I'll take the sea grapes I have to be careful around here with these currents Fun thing is that actually right there where the tiger shark is in that location there's even I believe one of those seashells that allows you to actually go and uh, recover oxygen from them. Are you seriously trying to tell me that there's no oxygen in here? Trying to capture like multiple fish at the same time, but uh, tricky to do that. There's our oxygen. There's even some meal or dish. Ah, crap! And there's also the damn shark. Come on, keep swimming. Keep following me, you knucklehead. If you insist on being taken into my sushi restaurant, I don't mind, you sell well. Unfortunately, right now I can only turn him into the basic sushi meal. I would need to hunt the different variety of in order to make the shark head meal and even then you like have to actually be able to pick up the damn thing in the first place and it's not guaranteed uh, so question is if we want to rotate the net gun for some other weapon 
which will allow me in return to actually uh, deal with the damn tiger shark because i don't think i'll be able to beat that shark to death with this hammer just fyi yeah both of them nice mackerels Careful with the currents. So we have one more dive today. Plenty of buffer fish. Buffer fish, if I have the sniper rifle, I can take them out and make the deadly form of, of uh, sushi to be consumed by whoever is interested. deeper because I do not have the headlamp with this I can do damage to the tiger you see this is what I'm talking about here is where there's the oxygen shell which means that the shark is over here somewhere but with the net gun I won't be really able to do too much here this is the brown seashell. I think I'm missing like a purple one or something. Tiger is right above me. I need again these bone pieces. Man, that's a big ass shark. Is there a weapon somewhere around here? There's a silver bowl. I won't be able to mess with the tiger with even the mines that I have. Okay, and we are officially overcumbered. So our movement is now heavily affected. I can overcumber myself even more, but I kind of don't want to around the tiger shark, especially be total suicide. Uh, on the way up, I believe there was another oxygen tank somewhere. So if I'll be able to get that, I have the definite insurance of being able to reach the surface level on time. Without my oxygen level going completely kaput on me. Uh, it already happened to me. It's kind of awkward, uh, you lose uh, almost everything, really not good, and I don't like to use the uh, retrieval points because maybe I misunderstood it, but it says that you can like take out only one item, and if you pick up like multiple important things, I, I just don't know. So we're just gonna swim up, 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 up. We have caught the jellyfish. I'm gonna try to capture more jellyfish. And we're just gonna have some fun with it. If I'll be able to take the two pair. That's awesome. Okay, there's our oxygen tank, but we're like 30 meters. From reaching our goal. They're grouped up like this, even though this fish looks more like it would be suitable for your aquarium. I'll take it. 70 kilos. take even the agar because if i recall correctly i think i will have to drop it off as well for the um uh, collection 
or the National Geographic or the Oceanic application. Still having trouble calming down, just like Lush Chin did when she first came face to face with Fenrir. Mm -hmm. Since you found the location, I'll reward. I'll reward you for it. I like to do honest dealings. Yeah. Now then, let's begin the Lesh Chen rescue yeah. mission. Take this gas cutter. Okay. You'll see a spot that can be cut into when you reach the ship. There will be a button yeah. prompt. Cut the weak point of the iron door and you'll be able to enter the yeah. ship. Just retrieve the pink delivery box that has Lesh Chen from inside the ship. Should be simpler than yeah. you think. But I saw a huge tentacle taking the ship. It looks extremely yeah. dangerous. Yeah. Do you mean to say that it's okay for Leshen to expire in the darkness down there? Yeah. This mission must not be delayed for a moment yeah. longer. Uh, Alright, I get it. Oh well. I'll try going down there. Trust me, buddy, I'm not excited about this as well. So we have white spotted jellyfish. Wow, that's a lot of them. We have even the shark. Parrotfish, tier 5, Big Eye Trevally, tier 2 is only like 24, so this at level 5 is nowhere close. And the Pyramid Butterfly Fish is just, no, 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 no. Agar, Soy Sauce, Kelp, Sea Grape, Salt, Black Vinegar, nice. Let's take a look at if we can donate anything. Deliver. More research points. If we reach the next rank, we get the Eco Gemstone Bracelet. I'm not sure what does it do. I need Pink Shell and I can deliver the Kelp. And we can deliver Barracudas as well. And that unlocks even more missions. Remove Jellyfish. I haven't seen this, so probably it's in... Either deeper water or I don't know what I'm looking for. Spider starfish, purple starfish, you see the depth at which these are living, so we're nowhere close. Uh, okay, we're getting like gold star quality here. Probably because I'm able to catch them alive or something. That can affect the thing, but I don't think I'll be able to get the, the tiger shark in that fishing net. I'm just sorry. We still need a bunch of followers in order to reach gold star. And do you have something useful for me? Okay. Uh, I think I'll keep the small net gun for now. So let's see if we can go and find the shipwreck again. Seems like we're diving at the same location. So it should be technically easy. I really do hope I will come across some of the things that I'm looking for. Maybe upgrade of tier 3 it would be nice. Uh, I have to focus on my missions first, then I can screw around with like a tiger shark or something. something useful definitely take the cheap Japanese sword you already even came across the sharp variety so they do exist be some harpoon attachments Fortunately, I don't need the basic gun seen the moray eel don't need the lionfish I'm taking the sea grape because uh, one of the deliveries was specifically for it so 
Why the hell not? Maybe soy sauce or something useful? Turmeric? Well, ticket. Since it's like barely registering. Barracuda! And there's a shark. Problem with the shark is. Uh, if you don't have the rifle, you're screwed. And this knucklehead is not really letting me hit him with the harpoon. And the shark is following. Come on, babe. Nice. So I'll try to bypass the shark. Another Barracuda! So what was it, like three hits? You can do it, Dave. We're at 14 kilos. This must be the door, let's try using the gas cutter. Turn on cutter and use mouse to move. Keep your movements inside the circle. This is gonna suck. I have really shaking hands. I don't know why, but I would not want to become a surgeon because I'm just afraid of what would happen. I'm usually just afraid to cut my own nails, to be honest with you, but it is what it is. Perfect! It, I was in too much of a hurry to properly tell you how to use it, but you figured it out going through the open door now. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna need a different weapon or something. The space below seems larger than expected. Take a look around, Dave. Oxygen, ammo. I feel like I definitely need to swap out the weapon right now. So I'll take the try shot. Two oxygen pieces. I'll definitely take the short sword. It sounds almost like there's a creature snoring. But it will be underwater. I guess. Should I take one of the oxygen... Yeah, sure, let's go for it, just to be on the safe side. Are we heading for, like, a boss fight? We're heading for a boss fight. The pink delivery box with less chun inside. Wait, more importantly, look at that giant squid! So that's our culprit, I guess. It knows a good thing when it sees it, even if it's just a squid. It seems to be asleep. Sneak up and bring back quietly. I've come too far to go empty-handed back. I guess I'll try approaching quietly. How do you approach quietly underwater? That wasn't quiet. Okay. That was bad. It's a wing! I need to get back. Dave, don't tell me you're going to chicken out. Use the gun I gave you. The harpoon will be of no use. Oh, crap.
Oh, let's see search ammo. Thank you for the scooter. I did not even notice that one over there. This is annoying. So they can come from the top too. Oh come on, it like barely scraped me. I need some oxygen in here. And they, I cannot touch the damn thing because it keeps hurting me. And that keeps using my oxygen. And now that I'm in this zone, the tentacles. Of course. I have two rounds. If I F it up... Then I'm screwed. Come on. Of course. I have to look for more ammo. I'm uh, not gonna be able to do much without it. And I still have like one more oxygen reserve in here. So I have to be careful with how much damage I'm willing to take. I'm trying to dodge the attacks. Should I comment about the fact that he has some sort of Japanese doll? And it's abducted by a freaking squid. see his pink delivery box bring it back quickly it's waiting rescue <laughs> telling him won't do any good I'll have to go and tell dr. bacon mm. huh, the box is pinned under the squid mm. tentacle I'll have to cut it away I wonder if it's edible I should try taking it to Boncho Okay, that one tentacle must weigh like, what, 100 kilos or something? Yes, that's the one. Come back to the boat. Well, the second dive apparently is not going to be a full-on thing, but... Yeah, a tentacle abducted a Japanese doll. I don't know, you take whatever you want from that. She thinks she hasn't been damaged. Oh, there, there's salt water yeah. everywhere. Whoops, I said Lishan's line by accident, though I'm the yeah. master. Yeah. Um, in any case, a promise is a promise. Yeah. Here you are, a deep sea headlamp. Yeah. It's a recent model that turns on automatically as necessary. Yeah. I must go help Lishan recover. <laughs> you are one weird guy. Well, I guess it's over for now. Okay. Come to think of it, I did bring this. What will I do with this giant squid tentacle? Mm. It smells so awful. I'm not sure if I can, if it can be used for cooking. Okay. I'll have to give Boncho a call. 
we have the beak of this beast. I have only barracudas. What if I try to call him now? What is it, Dave? I was helping Duff and I defeated a giant squid. That's incredible! I couldn't bring the whole thing, so I cut off a bit of its sanicle. Is it edible, perhaps? Hmm, of course. The ammonium chloride that helps it float gives it an awful stench. However, and because it's very tough, it's difficult to cook. Using conventional methods, I don't think we'll be able to offer it to our customers anyway. Why don't we close up shop for the day and hold a party with the squid? I've been so busy since we opened it, I haven't treated you or to any proper food despite your hard work. Wow, that sounds fantastic! Let me clean up a bit. Come to the sushi bar when you're ready. Dr. Bacon will be there as well, so I can tell him about the fish people I saw. Certainly, it looks like he was able to cook it. Dave, you're a bit late. Everyone's been waiting for you. Whoa, you finished all the cooking already. Why did everyone arrive though? A party with customers, there's been a lot of progress. Very good, very good. Has there? Restaurants should Put their customers first. Food, drink, services, and customers are the basic foundations of a restaurant. In the past, there was only a rigorous chef and his cooking. I was also here from the beginning. Yes, but you weren't very noticeable. Do you remember what I told you back then about the reviews on Cooksta? You said there wasn't any real mention of me. But now me, people do mention you. Update rarely. They said things like, he poured me hot green tea, he was working hard preparing the wasabi, he was friendly, he looked busy. Hey. Oh. Yeah, the customers are recognizing your hard work. Yeah. Well, that makes me feel good. Yeah, customers are honest and intuitive, more than you think. They know if you're sincere, kind, diligent, or skilled, and they react accordingly. Mm. That's why I find this moment hard to believe. To think that obstinate Bancho is working with people and holding parties. I think it's thanks to you, Dave. That makes me wonder what he was like in the past. I can't divulge details about someone else's past. But maybe someday in the opportunity presents itself, I might be able to tell you. <laughs> Dave, congratulations, world of Bancho Sushi is now getting around. It looks to be in very good mood. Look at this squid tentacle! It's the sort of thing you dream of eating as a child. There'll be more people flock here if such things are offered on the menu. Aren't we eating this because it's difficult to serve to customers though? Ah, you're right. What a pity. Everyone will want to try something that looks like this, regardless of the flavor. Regardless of the flavor, you say? There's no way Bancho could stomach that. Let's go with something else. Alright, about the doubts. I have a feeling there must be something down there. Things that'll make people jump out of their seats. If Dr. Bacon's research is successful, this place will be famous and filled with people. Hmm? You're right. When that happens, we'll make tons of money. So let's keep it up, Dave. Let's get rich together. <laughs> Uh, Dr. Bacon? Oh, Dave, what is it? I saw the sea people down below. You what? You really saw sea people and not dugongs? What did they look like? Were they dressed? Did they resemble humans? Uh, their torsos look like ours, but the sight of me scared them off into depths. I couldn't get a good look. That's too bad. It could have been an amazing find. That means we might encounter them in the depths. That's where the signal is the strongest. Perhaps there's even a village. A village? 
Yes, they're, they have artifacts, murals, language. They are beings with unique civilization. It would not be surprising if at least for them to live together in village of sorts. That would be quite defined indeed. An ancient civilization under the sea could be revealed to us. Dave, you're my best hope. Keep up the good work. A giant squid tentacle. It really is an ingredient that's difficult to handle. Surprising. Surprising the stench shows should allow me to reach its Push essence. It You're still studying the ingredients. Mm -hmm. Good work today. Bringing back precious ingredients. Mm -hmm. This is a difficult sort to prepare, but it's part of the fun of cooking. Mm -hmm. So how does it taste? Mm -hmm. The food's always been great, but today's even more mm -hmm. spectacular. Mm -hmm. Since there was a lot of it, I made many different dishes, though we won't be able to offer these to customers. There seems to be no end to the path of the chef. Of the chef. It's a fortunate thing to have a path to pursue. The same can be said to the study of ingredients. Dave, please keep preserving, and one day we'll succeed. I'm not sure what you mean, but sure, I'll be sure to bring back more fish. And I'll need to fetch more beverages because my uh, throat is closing up, so give me a second. Phew, that's good stuff. Bancho's food is so nice, I can understand the current popularity of the restaurant. Or maybe it's because I caught the fish. In any case, there's been a lot of stuff going on. Giant squid, sea people, there's no end to the mysteries of the ocean, even if it's dangerous. I suppose I'll go even deeper tomorrow. I wonder what I'll find. Eh, whatever. I think about that tomorrow. Time to toast with everyone and rest. Kampai. I think the guys responsible for the protection, the guys are really not happy with me killing the giant squid or something. Good morning. I must have drank too much yesterday. I feel sick. You did seem a bit excited. <laughs> you don't get gatherings like that every day. That sort of occasion calls for joviality. Ugh. You can't throw up here, Dr. Bacon. Ugh, I'm not the drinker I used to be. In any case, take the deep sea headlamp Duff gave you and try venturing down into the depths. It'll probably turn on automatically when you reach the right depth. And don't forget, you'll have to enhance your diving suit if you want to venture into the depths. I'll have to enhance my equipment first. Then, by the way, do you happen to have scuba? Oh man. I'm supposed to swim in there. He's asking me to enter the water after that. Oh, man. Unfortunately, because we did not really have guests and today VIP is going to show up. It's going to be a little tricky. Let's take a look at cook stuff. <laughs> Bus bustling. Still doesn't greet customers, just prepares the food. Oops. 
Yeah, I really need to be able to craft some of these things. Uh, but unfortunately, I need the ingredients for that. And I don't know the recipes from the top of my head. So that's going to be tricky. We need a pink seashell. And I need to take a look at how deep can I dive. We can currently go to 230 meters. That's, that's a lot. Okay, let's jump into that water despite everything we did pick up the jellyfish so i will be okay when it comes to preparing the meal for the vip guest okay maybe there has been like an update or a patch to the game or something oh crap wait so it was you the one who's been harming the ocean you even vomited, you disgusting creature. Ooh. Wait, that wasn't me. It was. I have no time for your petty excuses. Okay. Now that you've been caught by John Watson of Sea Blue, the guardians of the sea, you won't be leaving so easily. I'll turn you into fish food. Holy crap. Oh, my Poseidon! This is all your fault. You did this all to the precious sea. You're the one shooting bombs. And all I do is catch a few fish to keep the restaurant running. Why don't you look into the fishing vessels responsible for catching thousands of fish, not individual divers like me? Enough blabbing! I'll shut that yapper of yours. Here goes! He's gonna miss again. Okay, the problem here is my gun is not really suitable for... What this is. I'll have to swap. I don't want to use all my oxygen on this knucklehead. Holy crap. I'm shooting a volley of those things. I'll have to use the consumable. Are you done? How dare you fight back against me, John Watson, formerly of the Navy SEALs. That should serve as adequate warning, so I'll be back away for now to protect the environment. But I won't let you go unpunished if you persist in damaging the ocean. Well, we're watching you. What a knucklehead. Mm. A path has opened up in the direction of John Watson's mm. escape. Let's go that way to reach the signal. Yeah, but I need to switch my gun. So I guess this is like a uniquely scripted location for the purposes of the boss fight and all that jazz. Oxygen by here. This is gonna be tricky to remember this location in order to get the fudge out of here. There's that door. Oh crap, two lionfish.
Oh, okay, I can deal with them. I'll definitely take the oxygen tank. Thank you. Still don't know how to take the sea urchins, which sucks. I'll have to look into that. I'll have to fetch some kelp and other stuff. Now, because of the reward for some of the things which we have done, I did receive, like, salt and stuff like that. And salt is usually quite tricky to acquire down here. Look at them, two together. I want to try the fishing net, if it's going to actually work. Yeah, it's not... That's unfortunate. Most unfortunate. Man, I remember before I upgraded the harpoon gun, it took so many rounds just to put a dent into some of these species. And now with like one shot, you're able to start harvesting them. I don't need wood. I think it was like metal scrap or something, which I was told I'm lacking for crafting purposes of some gun or something. I need the pink seashell. Ah, crap, I missed. Can I try to capture the squid this way? Or cutterfish, sorry. Cuttlefish from South Park. That was a brutal episode of how they parodied the human centipede. Ugh. Now oh, let's seek another one. Barcuda, it's seven kilos. Quite a lot of barcudas. It's still too far. Some attachment to the harpoon would be nice. Thank you. It's kind of strange that I don't really get like upgrades for the harpoon itself. Ah, crap. Big seashell. There we go. I do need the relics or the skeletal pieces. I think we need like three of each this time in order to deliver what's asked of us. Crap, I have to deal with the Barracuda. Maybe not. Catching the fish alive definitely does help. the weapon to deal with the shark but we have plenty of that shark meat as is so I'm not really interested right now it's seven kilos added to what I'm carrying around are these macros I think they are they're tricky to catch, goddammit. Come on, Davy boy. <laughs> Easier this way. I'm out of ammo, though. But at least there's uh, the kelp. And something. Uh, sure, I'm not really thrilled about it, but it is what it is. Worst case scenario, I can use it on the shark. 
I'll have to find another way down because I have reached the official gap. So that sucks. I don't want to go over Combert already. I have only like 10 kilos to carry before Dave gets slowed down. a lot of these sharks. I already picked up the pink seashell. Another one of these knuckleheads, huh? I'm gonna pretend like that did not happen. Okay, we're still at 60. And now the headlamp should turn on. And we are in a brand new world, people. Whoa. Mm. Oh no, tube worms are blocking my path. What do mm. I do? Dr. Bacon, I have tube worms, tube worms blocking my path. Is there a solution? Mm. Uh, let's see. All right, two worms are said to hate UV light and will shrink away from it. One might near, uh, one might be nearby, so try opening the chest nearby. Chest nearby? Okay, swap. Whoa, what is that? Gotta be careful with these bottom feeders. Or these weird predatory species. Two worms. Whatever that is. I think I'm going in the wrong direction in general, asses. But I'll take it. be some brand new toys for me to play with. <coughs> Cat food? Mm. Should I give it to Momo? I don't know who's Momo. I haven't been introduced yet. Whoa! I need a pickaxe. Yep. Hey, how convenient. Some minerals can only be mined with a pickaxe. Acquire valuable minerals with your pickaxe. And upgrade your weapons. Nice. I know I should be going in different direction, but when in Rome, whoa, fancy looking jellyfish. I gotta say the studio has done an amazing job depicting these species. Beautiful job, beautiful. I have to find another way out. Uh, what's going on? Oh fudge, it almost looked like the thing is going after me. I don't know its name. I don't know every fish name. Come on, people. Snucklehead is over there. Still have plenty of oxygen to go around. Ah, uh, leave that over there for a while. I don't really want to 
catch this thing so i just want it to die because if i pick it up uh chances are i'm gonna go over my carry capacity limit and we're ridiculously deep so i'll just let that thing crap Will I be able to mine this? Of course you have to drop it on top of the damn fish. Fudge you. I'll take the amethyst. Sea snake whip. hold on to the pickaxe. Already we're overcumbered. I'll use the oxygen now. Oh, where the hell do I get over there? It has to be done somewhere around here. Whoa, that's beautiful. Gotta find beauty in these things because they actually do exist, which is so freaking weird, right? Be careful with the flashlight, though. Do have oxygen and there's even oxygen of that variety here. Oh, huh, the sea people from before. I don't understand you, buddy. Uh, they're seeing something. I can't tell what they're seeing. I'll have to call Dr. Bacon. You're trying to tell me there's signal down here. My goodness, wow! To think sea people were real. Simply incredible. Uh, they're seeing something to me, but I can't understand them. I think analyzing the patterns might allow us to translate. Come back to the boat for now. I'll try to think for a way to translate. She seems like he has been injured and should receive medical attention. That's the only thing I care about. Come on, Davy boy. I feel like it's ways to not try to catch some species of fish you know when in Rome Pacific fanfish thanks to the fact that I'm capturing them alive also it must help with the quality of the meat I don't know if this uh, ammonite can be actually captured it seems like a little ammonite. I don't understand how the prawns are not part of the sushi. I mean, tempura? Anyone? Anyone? Damn it, I was hoping both of those suckers would get caught in there. It looks like some red snapper or something. I don't have more ammo, but it's okay. As long as I'm gonna be able to somehow miraculously find that hole in the ceiling through which I should swim out, I'm okay. I really don't know if I should try to use the 
escape thingy. I don't think we can take anything else. Um, yeah. Can I at least cut the damn thing so the fish is free? Because it's gonna get liberated from the net. It's kind of like one thing which is on my mind now. Now that I think about it. I'm really overcumbered now. I have a lot of squid. But I was able to get the jellyfish. Uh, I think I should have like one more day or something before the festival when the jellyfish happens. So theoretically speaking, I should be able to capture even more of them. And by doing so, have plenty of the jellyfish meals prepared. Because, uh, well, if I understand the assignment correctly, we might receive some bonus points or bonus cash for serving jellyfish based meals for the participants. So who knows? Although I don't think I would want to try a jellyfish. I've been stung by one that was enough and I was a kid back then. So that hurt even more. Seems like I don't really have to look for the hole. I want to see what I'll come across. Maybe there will be something useful in some of these crates, but uh, maybe no. 10 meters. We're almost there. Did they change the top? The shallows? It's quite possible. Uh, I did expect sea people civilization to be real, but you think there are living sea people? This is truly the find of century. This is thanks to you, Dave. Ooh, black pepper. Still don't know about black pepper and sushi. Someone has to let me know. <laughs> Let's sell all the news outlets in the world about this. Wait, I think that might be risky. But why? That's how we'll get people flocking to this place. It wouldn't matter if we were talking about some ruins, but these are living sea people. Poachers are bound to show up. They'll start hunting the sea people, since that will be a way to get a lot of attention. You have a point there. How about we first make a translator to analyze their sound waves and figure out what they're saying? I think they have something to tell us. We'll first need a sea people stone tablet with their writing on it. As well as microphone and amethyst. I'm guessing right. Uh, the microphone should be below the sunken ship, and the stone tablet is likely to be in their record chamber. I hear you can mine amethyst at 100 meters or deeper with pickaxe. Mm. Well, record chamber, the ship, and <laughs> if you can't remember the locations, check the To Do app. I'll add the information there. It's fucking stuck on my phone. I don't want that. Stop putting applications on my phone. My god. Agar, salt, kelp, common cat food. Seriously? Cuttlefish. Pacific fanfish. Atlantic mackerel. White trevally. Nice. At level 2, it's 28. Atlantic mackerel at level 3, 33. Wow, Pacific fanfish is 65. Fudge. Hmm. Hey, it's the Pokemon guy. Okay. Yo! Okay. You seem energetic today, Sato. I saw boss card acquisition notification pop up on your marine card account. <laughs> it's this giant squid boss card. How did you get this? It's such a rare card. Mm. Well, I was just on my way to pick up a delivery, and this chance would have it. Okay, I don't have a clue what that means, but in any case, you're ma you're making amazing progress. <laughs> Try collecting all rare boss cards. Something good's gonna happen. Oh, and if you venture to new regions, for example, the depths, 
the automatic marine card AI system will unlock new card pack. Don't forget to collect fish cards in the new regions as well. Goodbye then, choo choo. My god, what have they done to Ash Ketchum? Uh, Udo, I have no idea who that is. Uh, wait, can I have a moment with you? Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, you are? <laughs> I should introduce myself first. I'm a reporter for Magazine Weekly Fish. The name is Udo. Oh, I've heard of the magazine too. I've covered unique fish species. Oh, you have? That's right. Yeah. I heard that Blue Hole is home to a variety of fish species. Is that true? Mm. You could say that. There are all kinds of fish species from around the world. Mm. Oh, I knew it. So I've come to the right place. Yeah. I'd like to take pictures myself for the magazine, but <sighs> unfortunately I can't dive. Oh. Speaking of which, would you help me take some pictures? Mm. Pictures? Yes, you see, you have that nice camera over there. Oh, it's one from Dr. Bacon. But I'm not expert in photography. I'm not sure if I'm good enough. Don't worry, if you're a reader of Weekly Fish, you will get a feel of what kind of fish to photograph. And of course, I'll reward you if you take a nice picture. <laughs> well, if you say so. Alright, it'll be nice to make a record of the magazine of this amazing world. You can take pictures of living creatures at a photo spot. Take your pictures to Udo to claim rewards. Some minerals can only be mined by pickaxe. So we have the amethyst. I believe I was able to pick up like quite a lot of it, thankfully. Uh, so I need to go find the microphone and the stone tablet. And after that, it's night. I don't know if I can hire another person or if I have an ad for more people. Well, we see that there's definitely a change now to the biome. They're trying to throw me off. But I'll succeed. Hopefully. Um, there's just that metal part. I do see the puffer fish. I don't need it right now though. I should have some puffer fish meat at the restaurant. Ooh, jellyfish. I'm tempted. Because if I'll be able to get the jellyfish, I get those jellyfish meals, it's gonna be awesome. More ammo. Uh, so I need to find the boat. Boat is more to the left. There's our moray eel. I did say I did not see them for a while, didn't I? Not really sure if I'll be now able to get this knucklehead. Did that do the trick or not? I don't think it's doing the trick. I did say that one of the key components is to have the headlamp in order for me to capture the marine eel. But I don't think that's just it yet. What is this? I can't really interact with it. Why not? What am I missing? Yeah, that's not working, huh? I had to try. It's definitely something new I haven't seen before. Huh. 
What's with that strange quarrel? Damn. Just make a friend, or what's going on? Ugh, that octopus. It sprayed me with ink. Just wait till I catch you. Here I come. Investigate the strange something. Oh, is it gonna swim over there? Wow, that thing is fast. I mean, fast, fast. Ugh, I finally caught up. You stay right. Oh no, it escaped, it escaped through the door crack. Uh, I don't think I can fit in there. Come to think of it, I can probably use the gas cutter from Duff to cut my way in. Just you wait, you octopus! Oh man. I'm afraid of what's gonna happen once they start changing the pace. the speed at which this moves. Whoa. Whoa. Easy does it. Oh crap, I almost like went out of the circle like twice now. Damn. Uh, hold on. I didn't want to go yet, but it somehow let me in. Whoa, there's something different. You, you've got nowhere to run now. Give up. I guess I'll have octopus sashimi for dinner. What's that thing? Oh, crap. It escaped again. It's so quick. Okay. Huh, it dropped something. Octopus cave. It seems to be an artifact. I'll have to identify it back at the surface. Maybe we will be able to catch eventually octopus. Not just the cuttlefish. Even though that's... Uh... This case over here is just so... Badly placed, that's what's causing all the issues. I was really hoping for like a photo or something new. Trying to like group up these guys together somehow. I don't really want the Barracuda right now. Oh wow, I can actually do this. Wow, I did not think that would work. Tricky location to try and get inside. I wonder what's at the end of this. There has to be a reason for all these damn currents, right? There's gonna be some rare weapon or like rank three or something. I oh, just level two, damn it. I'll refill the oxygen. The 
there's something below in here. <laughs> I knew it. Ooh, miso. Nice. Maybe we can make miso soup. Careful with this. That's an indication of a current to me. Okay, the game must have received some update or, or something, or maybe after those initial few days, uh, they change actually the biomes and it's more randomized. So it's not the same thing over and over again. Oh, now there's even fish fish. Maybe we have really killed the Kraken. Trying to get the macros together, but uh, more fish I have in one net, the better. Trying to think of the economy of uh, the ammunition. Crap. White Trevally, I think I need for some dish. Or some Trevally. One of the Trevally family. <laughs> okay, now just a stone slab. And buffer fish too. I think we need the Barracudas for one of the drop off missions. Even an ingredient, so definitely worth checking out. Maybe another miso. Oh, I'll take the salt. I'll be all salty about it. Oxygen wise, we're good. We have the oxygen tank in reserve. All I need to do go pick up the. Uh, go pick up the uh, tablet and then service at the sushi bar come on let's get a booze here buddy is that red snapper hard to tell I don't think we have done red snapper yet at the sushi bar what am I doing wrong I don't want to mess with the shark. These uh, these guys are awesome, but they take a lot of damage, and I don't think I'll be able to capture the snucklehead like this. So yeah, I need to find the entry to the temple. Ah oh, man. A lot of barracudas. Let's get the puffer fish. I'll try to poison someone. Everything is edible once. But remember that, people. Don't want the glass right now. Not sure what would I use it for. I'm sure eventually I'll be... Pissed off about not having enough glass for something. Wow, I'll be extra salty today. Even more of these, interesting. Uh, I don't need to actually go into this depth. I need to find the temple. That's my objective right now. type of uh, upgrade what I need on the uh, fishnet in order to reel in some of these bigger guys Yo, 
Damn, I... I can knock out these fish. Ha <laughs> Sure, let's grab the relic. Or the bone parts. Now, I don't want to swap the... Yeah, let's do that. Oxygen. You can really prolong your stay underwater here. Whoa. 39 meters. Careful with the currents. This is gonna be tricky to pass through here. Oh, I got caught in like the re remainder of it. Timing this is gonna be a key. Fortunately, when it's popped up like this, I cannot do too much. Boxing gloves? Okay, I'll need to reach this location now. Pink, blue, anything of value besides some weapon mod. Oh, it's a trigun. Don't need lead right now. I don't know what this glass pitcher is for, to be honest with you. Oh man, I could have skipped the whole damn thing with the damn currents. Oh man. Now I'm really angry. Where in the world? Oh crap, there's a freaking tiger. Right above me. That's a big boy. And I don't think I can go all Mike Tyson underwater with the punching gloves against a tiger shark. I mean, uh, there are extreme sports and then there's suicide. I found it. I wonder if there's gonna be fish now even inside here. That wasn't there before, but how convenient. Good, I got all the materials. I should be able to make Sea People Translator now, I think. I should deliver it to Dr. Bacon. That's a killer back tattoo piece. Right? All over your freaking back? <laughs> the smiling guy? <laughs> Don't do that. Was there this box before? I don't remember right now. I'm trying to... Catch more of these knuckleheads. We're getting close to our limit. When was that a problem, right? Uh, yes. Oxygen. I think I'll take this metal scrap. I think I need it. Just better to have it than not. Why have I never left the seat overcumbered? I don't think ever. I need ammo. What is that? 
over there. A new region. How many regions or biomes are there, you think? Another octopus cave. Huh. Let's just place it on a different spot this time. Then it was on the left, now it's on the right. Oh wow, that shark just like zapped in. Huh, how funny. Come on, Dave, I believe in you. Man, this guy's ears would explode. I would need different gun. Marine eel and a shark combo. And that shark slightly bugged out there. Oh, come on. Whoosh. I don't think this is gonna work. But I can try. Are you gonna pass out? Can I skewer you in peace? Not the fish I'm hoping to get. Yeah, crap. Yeah, I see it. Whoa, you're fast, buddy. Thankfully, I picked up all that oxygen. Will you knock it the fudge out? Look at me boxing with fish underwater. Maybe I can really try to go Mike Tyson on that shark. Who knows how that would turn out. Ah, uh, theoretically, if I would pick up the shark meat, I'm really close to the surface. So honestly, I can use shark on the menu. Don't really know what I'll be serving. I still don't know what's gonna be the damn dish for the VIP. So that's a thing on its own. Turning it into something delicious. I left the tiger shark behind, and that thing eats literally everything. Even a freaking shell from a turtle. They're insane. Whoa, you had to visit a lot of places, but you managed to get everything. Now that's what I call lucky. I'll use these to try to make the translator in my lab. I'll need some time to make it. You can go about your business in the meantime. I'll be in touch soon. Alrighty. So let's take a look at that VIP guest, I guess. Barrel jellyfish, buffer fish, 180. That's a lot. I think it goes with like turmeric or something, no? Coral trout. Okay, so it's not red snapper. Uh, yeah. We have the reef shark head, so I can potentially make the meal from that. Octopus bracelet. A bracelet found in a corner while chasing down a nasty octopus. Use left control to dash for short distance. Equip the octopus bracelet to dash short distances with left control. Now oxygen is used, but the gauge needs to fill again for the ability to be reused. So we need to go... Okay, applicants. Uh, cooking, serving, procure, appeal 48. Uh, I think Toha Tohaku has quite the potential. 
Okay, so we have both of the charms equipped. Nice. Uh... Well, let's see how much am I gonna have to pay for this guy then. It's D-Day for a VIP. I'm not really sure that's the best term for it, but sure. Hello, viewers. This is Yui from Star the Chef. Now we're back at Bancho Sushi. What kind of sushi will the chef have prepared, I wonder? I have prepared jellyfish sushi. Ooh. Jellyfish? You mean like in Chinese called vegetables? Oh. Did you think that you could win the acknowledgement of Vincent Yamaoka while ignoring the traditional ingredients? <laughs> no way. <laughs> you call yourself a gourmet. Will you judge before you've even tasted it? Oh. Uh, all right. Bring it over then. <laughs> all right. I'll bring you one serving of jellyfish sushi. Absolutely love the thumbnails I'll be able to make from this. Yes. We haven't even opened for the guests yet. Wow! So this is jellyfish? The flesh is transparent. The white dots are pretty as well. Okay. What? You made it with blanched rice? You should have made Sure, it doesn't scatter by making gunkan maki instead. It'll dry up. Hurry up and eat. It's already been seasoned. Ugh. I know it can't possibly taste good, but since it's for the program, I'll try it. I love these thumbnails potential. It's awesome. Vincent, the look on your face. This is amazing. I can taste the sea as soon as I bit into it. And the jellyfish is nice and firm. And I taste something popping inside. Could it be flying fish for a weight? They're bigger than that. Caviar? No, that would have killed the jellyfish flavor. Could it be? Yes, I added some sea grape below the jellyfish. <laughs> Firm jellyfish flesh and sea grape, huh? This is the sea. I taste the sea. The sea. Where the sea kelp sway? Hmm. Mm. I can't help but admit it. This sushi is amazing, based on very deep understanding of the ingredients. Hmm. But why is it that you use such unknown ingredients instead of the proven ones? <laughs> the first reason is the taste. <laughs> Jellyfish has a gentle mild taste with strong texture, making it a perfect match for the scent and flavor of sea grape. The second reason is the potential. There are so many kinds of ingredients out here. Insisting on using only the verified few is the same as ignoring the infinite possibilities. Thank you for those amazing words, Pancho. Now then, it's time for the evaluation. Vincent? Hmm. All right, let's get into evaluation. Now, this is the jellyfish sushi that made Vincent Marvel and Mr. Bancho who created this dish. What will the score be? Come on. I get Bancho sushi 80 points. Whoa. Huh? Isn't that too low? You looked quite impressed while eating. <laughs> Listen, the sushi was excellent. This establishment lacks something, though. Mm. Eden combines many enjoyments. To think they're only offered green tea with this beautiful ocean in front of us? Come on. Romance. This place doesn't have enough romance and appreciation for the arts. I know that. That's why I'll give this place 80 points. As a side reward, however, I'll give you a refrigerator. Being able to drink cool, cold beer from that fridge would make the score 100. It'll be perfect. Wow, as expected of you, Vincent. That was an excellent opinion. Now, how did you like Star the Chef today? We'll be re really looking forward to Bancho Sushi's exotic sushi being served with beer. See you again next time. This was reporter Yui. I'll take the 1000 gold. Thank you. And 50 likes.
And now we have to pour beer. Damn it. Customers will now sometimes order beer after their meal. Pour them uh, their drinks and create additional revenue. Wow, Bancho, that's amazing. That picky Vincent acknowledged you. The tongue does not lie. Vincent has a point. Shall we try selling beer from now on? Okay, well, I guess so we have to take a look at the staff. Uh, I never know what these bubbles mean. Uh, 1307. Holy fudge, dude. Okay, let's hire this guy. Uh, he has higher cooking. So what I'll do... Swap. And add this guy. Ingredients prep master. Damn. Okay, let's train Raul. Or Raul. And if I train Kyoko, she'll be even better at service. And we can train Tohoku. Okay, nice. I'll use Ra Raul for service today. And once I will be able to acquire another potential candidate for uh, serving. I'll switch them so he will be uh, back in the kitchen. Okay, now uh, research. Nothing. Ingredients. We have some new stuff like pepper. Yeah, you see, Tiger Shark. We already had that guy. Menu. Well, what's on the menu? Beer is 30. Whoa. Wait, does that mean we are now gold certified on Cooksta? We are gold certified, I guess. Whoa, under UV light? Okay, that's stuff from uh, Ghost Hunters. We are gold. We are golden people. Whoa. Stellate puffer special sushi. Sea grapes special sushi. Trout sea grapes rice bowl. Big eyes uh, scad and soybean paste. Menu slot, kitchen staff, wasabi, added interior, plus 13. Oh, then there's platinum. Woof. 19 recipes, best taste, followers 200. I only wish getting followers to my channel would be this easy. But okay, we have 18 flame. Uh, I have the puffer fish. So let's get that. I don't know what the thumbnail for this video is going to be, honestly. High quality rice and top with lay talk. La talk? And we don't have enough. Okay. Uh, sea grape. Spotted jellyfish and salt. We can upgrade this. It would almost generate profit of 300. I will try it. 
So I'll probably try to focus on serving beer and cleaning around the bar. Okay, so we have 10 meals of this. That alone is just ridiculous. If I would enhance this, it can make more profit. Cuttlefish. I'll need to enhance this cuttlefish dish a lot. I can make the shark. I know it's quite the difference in price. But I'm willing to go for it. Now we have seven menu items. 65 for Pacific Panfish. White Trevally Kelp Soy Sauce. I have only one soy sauce. It's 93. We'll be able to make few portions out of it. So this is 48. Let's enhance it. Unfortunately, that cuts me off from being able to serve it. What do I need for this? Striped red mullet. Damn it. This was really popular. I need moray eel and turmeric. I need rice. Don't know how to get rice. I'll have to come across rice. Uh, soy sauce, yellow bag, agar, soy sauce. Unless I'll be able to like literally uh, purchase these resources from Cobra. I, I don't know how I'll be able to like increase the increase some of these things or provide some of these meals. Let's go with the macro macro scad. Let's go with this guy. 65 per serving. And we can serve the Barracuda. 10, 3, 5, 5, 5, 5. So that's 10, 20, 30, 43 servings. Let's do it, man. I'll go over here in case someone wants tea. Start serving people, people. Whoa, they're burning through that wasabi. Dish. Dish. Well, I'm I'm not Dish. even able to keep up with what's going on. Oh, she's able to serve also beer. That's awesome. Dish. I'm seriously falling behind like my servants are 10 times better at serving. I'll focus on cleaning up. Run to the back. First four, not bad, huh? Whoa, we made so much money. Awesome teamwork, people. So proud of you. Seagraves Jellyfish Sushi. Definitely, definitely good. 
The problem is I don't have access to these recipes outside of the sushi bar. And uh, that creates problems for me to try and keep track of the specific ingredients which I do require. Phew, I tried to do it alone, but it was too tough. I got a bit of help from Duff. Thanks to this, his help, you can now translate your words into C people language as well. Whoa! I'm curious to know what they have to say as well. I'll first make my way back to C people's location. Which means I'll need the UV flashlight and all the other stuff. But of course, because this episode is already like two hours long. Hey, what is it? Yeah. I spent some quality time with Les Chen and did some quiet thinking. Yeah. I realized that paying people back for help received was what a noble master would do. Yeah. Tell me, Dave, are you satisfied with your guns? Mm. Uh, they're fine. It'll be nice if they were stronger, though. <laughs> I guess it's time I stepped into the spotlight, so to speak. Yeah. I'll help you enhance your guns. Mm. Enhance them? How do you do that? Yeah. It's about making them stronger. Or imbuing elements into poison or electricity there's one thing you need to remember though only guns that have been created can be enhanced oh i see gun enhancements that sounds pretty useful duff you're the coolest person that i know uh, than i thought huh, what are you saying i'm just trying to be the best master i can be for less chen i think i've provided adequate explanation it's back to the word of pixies for me you weirdo okay now we can start upgrading guns to give them like uh, enhancements so that's awesome so yeah that's gonna be it for the episode we had the vip guest we had two boss battles there is a lot so hopefully someone is watching until this point i know that my reading has been totally awful on this one i do apologize i was hoping to record a bit more i just got carried away with all the events and so the episode is now longer than it should be but thank you all for watching and hopefully i will see you all at the next one bye bye for now